My name is Terry Hardy. I am a graduate, proud alumni of South Shore High School and the founding president of the South Shore High School Alumni Association. <coughs> it is with, uh, with deep sadness that I, I contemplate uh, the fight for uh, asylum seekers from Venezuela. And I mean no disrespect as I stand in opposition to what's happening here, but it is with much respect that I point to the people behind me and the people of this community to reflect the position that there's a lack of focus here when it comes to the priorities of the citizens of Chicago. We're all one Chicago, black, white, red, yellow, and as we see, there is a lack of respect for this community when it comes to making accommodations for others when accommodations have not been made for the people who live here. Yes. These people pay taxes, they are highly vested in this community, have been here for decades. And yet, this community suffers from crime, education, resources, mental health issues, and the list goes on and on and on. And the city is well aware of the problems here, but yet it seeks to turn its attention to helping others before helping itself, because we are a big part of the city. All over this city, there are black people. And when black people are ignored, this whole city is ignored. What you saw happen downtown with the young people is another opportunity to point to this building and other buildings like this that need to be empowered with programs and other opportunities to keep people engaged and help take them from where they are to where they ought to be. Redefining America is an on and on, ongoing situation. And we do understand that immigration has played a big role in the development of this country. But I tell you, Chicago is not Ellis Island, at least right here in South Shore. Black people live here and black people are a priority here. So whatever the decision that has been made or is in contemplation, I am not requesting but demanding that you consider your approach as not to step on the people that live in this community. I'm a proud graduate of this high school and I make an appeal also to the alumni of this high school, both local, regional, and national, and global. There are some very influential people that went to this school and I ask them to turn their attention back to this school, back to this community, and bring together the resources to reignite what this building once stood for. Yes. 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 Yes.